want to do it. And they're, you know, they're eight years old, but they're old enough that, you know, my name's Matt. I'm from London. I'm putting up the artwork. <laughs> it's a total one-man show. I do the work and put it out myself. Be very careful with the walls so you think you're going to hit a power cable. Like, oh. <laughs> Fabulous shit out there. I don't know if you've seen it. We're, we're here for our friend Matt. Our friend, friend Matt's Matt, having, yes. having a show here. Uh, he has one every few months. He comes back from England and he has like a different little art show. So we're here to, to support that. We love the Carlton Arms. We've got friends that work here. We've been to lots of parties here. It's just a great place. It's like it's it's a hotel, but every single room is designed by someone different. You can have like one room, it's like really mod, one room it's like Tudor. Where else can you see, you know, a, a live fast, die young, you know, mural on a wall? And don't even get me started on her. Ah, yo trabajo en el hotel hace un promedio de como de 15 años. No, pues yo me llamo Armando Pérez, todo el mundo me conoce por chino, vengo de Ponce, Puerto Rico. El hotel es algo pues muy especial, ve porque es algo diferente, un concepto diferente en hoteles, ve porque es un hotel de artistas, tú me entiendes, la gente viene aquí, decora su cuarto y está el cuarto decorado por año. Yo veo cómo está el cuarto cuando no lo decoraron y lo veo cuando el tipo lo realizó o el artista lo realizó y el cambio es bien diferente. Esta fotografía en la puerta, esto es de mi familia. Todo lo que hay aquí tiene un significado muy especial para mí, porque estos son años y años y años de lucha y de trabajo. Y es algo bien especial para mí para el hotel. My name is Teresa Yerkovich. I'm from Morgantown, West Virginia. And I work at a little hospital called Cheat Lake Animal Hospital. One of the things I like about my room that I'm staying in is the way I can like open up to Manhattan and look out my window and see what Manhattan, New York is like. And then when I want to get into my own little world, I can just shut it. Mm. And here I am, I got my own little world. <laughs> of my, and I can shut out the world and make up my own stories of my own room because it's unique. I feel like I'm a little kid discovering every little crook and cranny of, of a secret place. Now you see, noise, noise, noise. They checked out early, you know. Three rooms. One day. Oh. This is our hotel computer. Um, of course, it's our computer because we wouldn't have it any other way here. I mean, this is just the way things are, you know. This is our, what we call our office safe. Um, all the secrets you ever wanted to know about anything are inside, okay? Tell your friends, come again, okay? Thanks. Okay. Thanks a lot. It started with the people that actually worked here and um, they did some of the original artwork themselves, you know. Um, they would do the staircases in the building, they did the murals all up and down the staircases. And then it sort of happened where they decided to work on a couple of rooms because rooms became vacant and available. And um, it sort of started to change the whole vibe of the hotel, where it became more, um, more welcoming, more warm. And, um, they each tried to um, basically um, put their own little stamp on on a piece of the hotel in a way that would just bring positive uh, feelings. And it sort of continued to evolve where not only were the people that worked here doing rooms, they knew friends or had friends that were artists and um, they invited them to come do rooms. Well, I started doing this room, I think, uh, I think it was three years ago. It was in the summer, very hot summer. And uh, I didn't have much to do, so I decided to do a room, and uh, you know I liked the idea of the bar room. So I started going to garage sales, um, and uh, you know collecting all these uh, 
pictures and uh, mirrors and, and bar signs and then I just put it together. It took me like uh, two months and it was uh, great fun to do it. Like uh, the idea of the hotel with the art together is very exciting. Seeing the artists, seeing all these projects getting done and uh, you know it's, this is like a museum in, in, in some way and it's, it's fun, it's a lot of fun to work here for the people that come, for the artists, for the project itself. It's really a good place to be. When you come into this hotel and it says Carlton Arms Hotel and it's like, you think, oh, it's going to be a ritzy place? Uh-uh. It's like a fantasy story.